Steven Adams and Carl Anthony Towns had some epic battles while Adams was wearing an Oklahoma City Thunder uniform. Yeah. Jaron Jackson about his experience going to Lalo Mare High School in Indiana. He said it's the reason why he's in the NBA. Yeah. And see if the shots can keep dropping. So far, so good tonight. Jackson. Ooh. And he bullies his way in for a bucket. Yes, he does. He's he's just a, a study in activity level. Russell knocked it away, but right into the hands of Adams. Dilo with another good defensive play. And if you've watched D'Angelo Russell over the past few games, Dave, you got to go back and watch. <laughs> yeah, because because numbers don't quantify what he does on the floor. Towns draws the foul as he puts it on the deck. Anderson had a big game in Memphis as well. It's a big part of helping the Grizzlies get that win. Towns, Adams able to block the shot, and then both of them fall to the floor and ends up in Ant's hands, and Edwards cans the triple. The, the, it's going to swing. The pendulum swings back for these three-point shooters. Once they go through a long drought, you know it's getting ready to come. Adams shooting a career-high free throw percentage on the season. And career high for him is 27.2 points over the last six going back to that game. You have 33 in that game, 32 in the next. Adams up one for two at the line so far here tonight. Let's get a quick word from our friends at TSR Injury Law. Minnesota, by the way, coming into this game. If you're not over, if you're not 70 or above, you are really in, a, in trouble. And Minnesota's at 66%. Adams too strong on that one. Brandon Clark gonna check back in. He had a plan when he started his tattoos, by the way, too. That is, I mean, really well done. Reed, rainbow three won't drop. Vanderbilt fight for it. Adams comes up with it.